Time for another drag race, more car versus bike. But Matt, I can't help but notice you're not in the car. I'm not going to be in the car. I've got, look, my lovely racing driver, Sam, is in the car. This is a Polaris, right, off-road buggy. They take a bit of skill to get the best out of. Sam's a racing driver, you're a racing rider. I thought it'd be funny to have you against someone with some skill in a proper off-road vehicle with your sort of not quite so proper <laughs> off-road <laughs> whatever, the, whatever the hell this is. Right, so we're going to try and beat that Polaris. 112 horsepower, is it? 112 horsepower, 750 kilograms, and um, 29,000 pounds, whereas you've got... Yeah, a five grand, a five grand's worth of Jigsaw with mods, 140 horsepower, 198 kilos. So I think the big difference here is this is a uh, bodged, <laughs> modified, lashed up superbike. You're making excuses, aren't you? I am getting ready, yeah. That is a bespoke off-road buggy, so hopefully... <laughs> All right there, Sam. <laughs> He's yeah, he's getting bored of your excuses. Basically, I think that you can go super quick on this. It's very agile, it's quite impressive, it's got loads of power. That's got a proper driver behind the wheel, but it's nowhere near as quick as this. I'm actually quite confident that you could do quite well in the series of challenges that I've got for you for both of these two vehicles to race. Right, enough talking, let's get on with it. Be nice. The first race we're gonna run is an uphill drag race. Whichever vehicle wins gets two points. The loser gets one. If it fails to make it up the slope, no points. Three, two, one, go! Oh, that was so close. That was wild. <laughs> That was epic. <laughs> and I love just how competitive it was. Sam, how do you think you did? <laughs> I don't know who landed first. I think that's who wins. <laughs> no, unfortunately, who crossed the cone first? Do you I don't you... know. Well, it was actually. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> the bike won that one. Well done, Chris. I was trying hard then. <laughs> Utterly amazing. So close. Bike won it. Two points to the bike one to the car so we've uh, we've just finished the uphill drag race which i won just but it was sketchy now we've got the round the tree race so it's through some four before ruts and puddles 180 turn and then back through the other side so it's going to be tight and this one relies on a fair bit of rider skill so <laughs> i hope i'm up to it three two one go <laughs> That is no joke. Whoa! <laughs> I forgot to stop it! <laughs> Sam, can you go again? I forgot to stop the timer. Really? Yes. Do you reckon you can go quicker? I can try. You look quite wet. Sorry. Poor Sam. Ready? Three, two, one, go! He's gonna go quicker, I bet. Whoa! I'm not going to reveal the timer until Chris is gone. <laughs> Chris is looking nervous. That's what's happening here. Give us a hug. <laughs> you couldn't see the car. There's you a water splash just there, Chris. Is there? Just a, well, show me where. Just, just over the crest. <laughs> No pressure, yeah? <laughs> I'm quite nervous. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Come on, Chris. Come on, come on, keep me up in agony. That was amazing. <laughs> Right, so, <laughs> so are you ready for this? Go you've on. got a time of 
12.8 seconds. That is so quick. <laughs> well, it wasn't as quick as Sam. Yes! I did 12 <laughs> seconds flat. No! <laughs> I can't believe it. That's, Point eight. Yeah, so point eight. How am I wetter than you? <laughs> I don't know, but... <laughs> That's what costs a point eight of a second. I should be wetter. Yeah, <laughs> you should be wetter. So there we go. You get one point, you get two. So it's three points apiece. Oh. For this next race, they're going to drive or ride up this slope, turn around at the top, and then come down these steps here. Oh, we're timing them. Let's find out which is quickest. You ready, Chris? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Chris is a nutter, here he comes. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> 12 12.06. Wow. <laughs> Good luck, Sam. Three, two, one, go! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, I got soaked! That was awesome! <laughs> <laughs> I wish I hadn't been standing there. I really wish I hadn't. You just did. No, let's do you first. <laughs> you did a 12.06, right. which is really, really quick. Why are all the challenges 12 seconds? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> or are they? Or are they more? Are they 11? Sam, you did an 11.21. 11. Yes! <laughs> and as an added bonus, you got me at the same time. <laughs> Fair play. <laughs> uh, this doesn't feel comfortable. Anyway, two points to you, one point to you, it's five, four. The next challenge is to race through here, slalom through the cones, round the top, back, slalom through those other cones, over this jump, through the water splash, U turn, then back over this jump across the finish line. Sam is going first in the Polaris. Three, two, one, go! Oh, good to up. <laughs> Click the code, <laughs> rip the reflector off it. This is really impressive. Wow. comes across the line what will Chris do three two one go <laughs> oh, he clipped a cone as well You need to come fast, you need to come fast. Oh. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> so sketchy. <laughs> you look smug. What, I have no idea. <laughs> Chris? <laughs> Actually, no. Sam, you did a 26 89. I don't know what that means. No. <laughs> Very well done. <laughs> You did a 27, <laughs> 77. <laughs> oh, I was so close. <laughs> Two points to Sam, one to you, Chris. Seven, five. Oh, Sam. Now we're going to have a simple drag race. Let's find out what happens. <laughs> It was close for a very short period of time, but Chris absolutely destroyed him. Clear, clear win. It's that thing of the unknown, right? If I was doing that on my KTM rally bike or a motocross bike, 
they've got suspension travel and you know they're designed to hit stuff at that speed. With this, there's just no telling what it's going to do and every bump it hits it starts to hop and swap side to side. It was, that is one of the most exciting things I've done drag racing ever. I kind of want to do it again. <laughs> Two points to Chris, one to Sam. That means the scores are eight points to Sam and seven to Chris. All to play for as we go into the last challenge. Final one of the day is a big nasty hill climb over there. It's loose, it's rocky, it's sketchy. But there's only one way to approach it on this bike and that's just send it as fast as you can and hope for the best. So that's what I'll do. What we have here are two hills. There's one there, it's pretty steep, but there's a steeper one just over here. Now this is what's gonna happen. They're gonna get to choose which hill they go up. If they go up this hill, there's a maximum of two points if you win the challenge if both go up the same hill. However, if you go up that hill, there's more points to be had. So if you win, and the fastest up that hill, you get four points. I don't know who is gonna to choose to do what. Maybe they'll do that hill, maybe they'll both do that hill. I don't know, let's find out. Okay, Sam, so what you decided to do? So I've walked it and there's a kicker at the end, right? It goes up by about another five degrees. The thing is, I know I can bag points in that, but I know whether I barrel roll down it or don't make it up, it's zero points. This is a strong thing, it's got a good roll cage, so it doesn't matter, but I don't want to lose. So I think this is the option. I think Chris has to try and go for a win, uh -huh. and I don't think he can get up there. Okay, right. So you're playing it safe, you're yeah. gonna just fly up here, hopefully be able to be quicker than him up here. Yeah. We will see. So let's get on, and I'm gonna time you up here, see how quick you go. Good luck. Three, two, one, go. Here he comes. That was bloody quick. 3.92 for Sam. Can Chris get up there quicker? I doubt it. He's he, got to go for that. He's going to have to go for it. So Chris, Sam just did a 3.92, which is blooming quick up there. He's one point ahead of you now. If you can go up there quicker, it'll be a dead heat. You will draw. Right. If you can make it up there, you get four points, so which I means win. you win. So the best I can do is a draw on that hill. Yeah. But I still might not beat him. You still might not beat him got to be all or nothing, isn't it? <laughs> Are you sure you really want to go up there? Not really, but... <laughs> you don't have to do it. No. Do I have to do that in any particular time? You just have to get up there, I think. Just have to get up. How many attempts do I... that's fair enough, Sam? Formal protest. <laughs> <laughs> How many attempts do I get? You've then? got to do it in 3.92 no, seconds. One attempt. One attempt. One attempt, no practice, straight up. Yeah, I think that's fair. I'll say what's fair. Right. <laughs> We've taken the power away. Sorry. Basically. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> if you can get up there, you win. Right. In the first attempt. If you can do it on the second attempt, it's a draw. All right. Yeah, come on. Because, I mean... All right. Yeah? Good. Let's Fair do enough. it. Is this where the bike gets destroyed, I wonder? Mm. You've still got to do another thing with it. <laughs> is it a little GSX-R? Everything we've done has been the sketchiest thing I've done all day. <laughs> but that takes the Man, biscuit. You deserve that. Four points and look, I timed it. 4.51. 4 so similar to like that's just less than a second <laughs> slower than he went up there. Are you actually, is that really you? <laughs> yeah. Is that real? There's a bit of adrenaline going there. Blimey heck, you oh. nutcase. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, so, we've done a lot of these drag races and it's been a lot of fun but can i just say this has been the best day ever <laughs> <laughs> oh man i'm so impressed with like your riding skills this is not supposed to do this <laughs> no <laughs> no one told it though did they <laughs> wow what a machine seven plus four eleven points to you sam eight plus two ten that <laughs> <laughs> that was a rather radical end to that challenge. I must say, thank you very much for giving me the opportunity to nearly kill myself. <laughs> I don't want to do it again. <laughs> I, honestly, going up there, like, I was just watching you fly up there. It's so quick, and the time that you did was amazing. Like, only a, less than a second that it took the Polaris to get the shorter, less steep slope. 
But what was really interesting was at the top when you went like with your hand. You know, yeah, like was that hand was shaking. legitimate adrenaline. And I thought of you just joking, but then, wow. <laughs> it was, again, with a hill climb on a bike, generally you don't end up having massive crashes. You have to do something quite wrong to have a huge crash. But it was like the adrenaline of, I really wanted to win. <laughs> Sam was so competitive all day. Yeah. It made it a real good head-to-head. -head. And I have to say, you know, all things being equal, the Polaris was phenomenal around the whole park. I just used stupidity and commitment to win <laughs> at the end. The thing is, Chris, this this is a superbike meant for the road. And yeah, you've off-roaded it like some kind of like trials bike. It's just completely nuts. <laughs> this man is insane and extremely talented. <laughs> very kind, Matt. But yeah, we've seen lots of these super bikes off-roaded on the internet video. I've been wanting to give it a go for ages. Matt, you gave us the perfect excuse. So thanks ever so much. Oh, thank and you. And I can't wait to see what you bring out next. <laughs>